76 channel today for my Coleman enthusiast. A quick video I'm just going to share with you guys. Another thrift store find. Yes, $12.99 you see there. And by the uh, appearance on the outside of the box, you should be able to tell that this is the Coleman catalytic heater. This is the 511A700 model, uh, which varies from the model, the 513 that I shared uh, a few years back and did uh, a test video on um, <clears throat> showing how kind of what the what kind of burn time you could expect out of one um, with a full tank. So, uh, but that's not what this is. I'll do a little quick comparison, but let's pull this out of the box here. We'll keep unboxing. I don't really do those. <laughs> um, it does one cool thing you note. Uh, there is the original price sticker. I tried to read it even with the magnifying glass. It's just too faded uh, to read. It would be kind of cool to see. It does even have like a ship to address stamped on the top here, like the store that was sold from, or, or ship to to be sold from. But um, as you can tell, probably, it looks really, really clean for a 19. This is a 1970 model. And um, I, at first look, I, I was under the impression that it had never been lit. Uh, with a little curtain more uh, scrutiny, I found out. Or I found some soot here on the inside there. Um, so it looks like it's been lit at least once. Um, but no real discoloration here in the element area. Nor in the paint on the on the grill, the heat shield here. So um, all in all, uh, heck of a score for $12.99. And I probably won't ever actually like it. I know that might be blasphemy, but... Uh, I don't know, it's in such good shape, I kind of want to just keep it that way. And, you know, and add it to my collection. So to slide in here, there's a difference with the 513. Um, the 513 model has, for one, it has this adjustable leather lever. So obviously it's a little higher in model, meaning, you know, it has a little more options. Um, so with that, you know, you can go, you guys can check out that other video. But it's adjustable from the um, 3,000 to 5,000 BTUs. That was its biggest feature. Uh, at first glance, it does appear maybe, uh, maybe same size fuel, fuel tank, um, but uh, way cool. This one, you know, puts out 5,000 BTUs, non-adjustable. So there you go. Uh, thanks for all, uh, thank you guys for watching. Please provide any feedback that or any questions you may have about the products and I'll uh, try to respond as quickly as possible and uh, if you're a Coleman lover subscribe to my channel because uh, you know I do lots of different types of videos but I do 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 quite a few on Coleman products and I'm willing to do other videos on Coleman products or answer questions or even post videos uh, to answer your questions if you have you're having trouble with uh, either a lantern or a heater or uh, the cook stove or whatever um, I'm more than happy to uh, try to dive in if I have the same product or a similar product to uh, help explain to you how to repair one or fix one uh, so you guys all have a great day